I'm Dr. Pam King, and you're listening to With and For, a podcast that explores the depths of psychological science and spiritual wisdom to offer practical guidance towards spiritual health, wholeness, and thriving on purpose. Hello, friends. I'm so glad you've joined me today to spend a few minutes. So in this episode of With and For Practices, we offer a short practice from Season 1, Episode 3, Cultivating a Healthy Mind, The Neuroscience of Awareness, Connection, Insight, and Purpose, with Dr. Richie Davidson at the Center for Healthy Minds at the University of Wisconsin. Richie's research reveals that awareness and attention are core and central to our life satisfaction and our ability to intentionally thrive. Join Richie and I for just a few brief moments to pause and deepen and cultivate a sense of awareness. Take a few deep breaths and enjoy. And so let's find a posture that is upright, but not too tight, not too loose, something that's comfortable. And let's first begin with a moment of awareness, bringing our awareness into our bodies, into this moment. And one of the things that we like to emphasize whenever we begin a period of practice, however short it is, is to reflect for a few moments on our motivation. And let's see if we can find within us a place that it has an altruistic motivation for our practice, recognizing that calming our minds and opening our hearts is beneficial not only for ourselves, but is beneficial for all of those others that we touch in our lives either directly or indirectly. And so let's spend a couple of moments simply reflecting on that. Now let's bring into our mind and our heart a person that is close to us, someone we know and love. And it could be, again, a family member, a close friend, or it can be an animal. And so bring that being into our mind and our heart And let's spend a few moments reflecting on a period in that person's or that being's life that may have been difficult in whatever way. And as we breathe, on each in-breath, let's imagine that we are removing the difficulties. And on each out-breath, imagine that we are sending love to that person. As we breathe in, The difficulties begin to recede. And as we breathe out, we're extending our love and our wishes for that person to be happy and to be free of suffering.
And as we end this very short period of practice, we always sandwich our procedural learning between two other components. We began with finding our motivation, and let's end with a dedication where we dedicate whatever insight, whatever benefit we may have gleaned from this very short period of practice. We dedicate it to the well-being and the welfare of others. and reflect on how we can bring a simple practice like this into our everyday lives in ways that can be beneficial to others. So let's open our eyes and return to the conversation. With and For is a production of the Thrive Center at Fuller Theological Seminary. For more information, visit our website, thethrivecenter.org, where you'll find all sorts of resources to support your pursuit of wholeness and a life of thriving on purpose. I am so grateful to the staff and fellows of the Thrive Center and our With and For podcast team. Jill Westbrook is our senior director and producer. Lauren Kim is our operations manager. Ren Jurgensen is our social media graphic designer. Evan Rosa is our consulting producer. And special thanks to the team at Fuller Studio and the Fuller School of Psychology and Marriage and Family Therapy. I'm your host, Dr. Pam King. Thank you for listening. Thank you.